Well, hello everybody, it's your buddy Michael here from the West Star Marketing and Media Group, West Star MMG. Thank you all for joining me today. Hope you all have had a great day and a great start to your week. Got a variety show for you. Got several little things here I want to uh, get out of the way so I can get them put up and put in the collection and so forth. Uh, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Not going to try to want to try not to do a lot of rambling and talking today. And uh, just get straight to the point. All right, we've got a uh, letter coming in from Columbia, South Carolina. If you notice the date, it said the uh, the date was November 2021. And back in uh, uh, the fall of last year, I was contacting several barbecue teams and individuals on Instagram who uh, have barbecue accounts and so forth. And I was requesting stickers. And I uh, had a, a nice little success with those because for someone who's not in that in that uh, realm or in that genre, uh, you know, they do a lot of, of uh, sticker swaps and so forth. Uh, they agreed to send me something. And here's one that I missed. Back Porch Barbecue from down in South Carolina. Florence, South Carolina, actually. So uh, if you uh, are into that kind of thing or want to check out what these guys are, uh, are cooking up, uh, the link to their Instagram account will be below, but Back Porch BBQ, Back Porch Barbecue, got the old chicken there, the old Gamecock maybe, um, on their logo there. So I like that, so thank you guys for sending that, and I sincerely apologize for taking so long to show that. Uh, I've got, a, if you all can see to the right of me here, here I am rambling, I said I wasn't going to do it, but to the right of me I've got uh, a 14 shelf, um, kind of like cubby hole type thing, here to the right of me, and uh, it's completely full still yet. A lot of NASCAR Hero cards in there, though. But anyway, all right, let's get into this. How about some actual fan pack action? We got the Chicago White Sox. And uh, normally they send um, about the same thing every year. This was a little bit different, and I've noticed that uh, a lot of other people have gotten the same thing. They sent a couple of, uh, actually they sent three, uh, like cardstock type pocket schedules uh, and I know they had a kind of a, a bizarre start to the uh, baseball season this year and they also sent a, uh, a magnet a scheduled magnet or a magnet schedule I guess you should say and um, that's all they sent usually they send a sticker and uh, some information about the team and so forth so they changed it up a little bit but anyway that's what the Chicago White Sox sent me how about another fan pack an actual sports team fan pack folks Coming in from, oh yeah, America's team, the Dallas Cowboys. And uh, they, uh, when I contacted them on their website, they came back and they gave an email address, which, uh, folks, I do not have any longer. This came in uh, about a month or so ago. Uh, and said, if you'll email uh, or send an email to this address, then uh, we can get you a fan pack out. And I said, well, let's go ahead and do that. So that's what I did. Here they sent a, uh, a 2021 uh, pocket schedule. I always love pocket schedules regardless of whether it's for the current year or past seasons. They also sent a 2021 team photo and oh, oh get ready boys. Oh yeah. A 2020 picture of the Dallas Cowboy cheerleaders. Ooh look at that. Miss J don't watch this video. I'm keeping that picture. Alright. That's from the Dallas Cowboys. Now I always try to throw in a hero card in these videos uh, and I've been showing off hero cards from last year because I was so far behind and so inconsistent with making videos and so forth um, that I still have some to show but this is one from 2022 this is actually one that I, I won on Instagram and I wanted to go ahead and get this out there so I could give these guys some credit and this is coming in from Derm Dude and uh, they make some some oils and some creams and so forth for uh, uh, beards and tattoos and some manly parts and so forth and that's almost about that but uh, you need to go check them out if you're the least bit interested dermdude.com and uh, like I said I won one of their giveaways which was for an autographed Spencer Boyd hero card and uh, so I wanted to uh, give them a shout out and thank them for sending that here's the back of it as well and uh, for those of you that um uh, are into collecting hero cards you know that uh, Spencer Boyd has a bunch he has a lot of different sponsors which good for him because it keeps him on the track and uh, Spencer Boyd is actually one of the uh, uh, as far as social media uh, 
uh, people on social media, he really takes care of his fans. And uh, if, if you follow him and you post about him and tag him in your posts and so forth, you know what I'm talking about. So, Durham Dudes, thank you very much for sending that. Really appreciate it. And uh, to go right nicely in my collection of hero cards. Now, visit Galveston down in Galveston, Texas. Folks, look at this big hefty, uh, hefty package here that they sent. Uh... And this is, of course, some travel guides and so forth. Some of you guys like to see these. Some of you guys really don't care about them. But I want to go ahead and show them since uh, the uh, Department of Tourism did send uh, out a bunch of stuff. Just real quick. And I've got a, a bunch here in my hand. So hang tight. Uh, of course, they sent the, uh, the, the, the travel guides. Here's the island. So, you know, Galveston's down there on the coast and so forth. And then the Texas Heritage travel guides so sent some of those they also sent a bunch of uh brochures and rack cards here's the galveston railroad museum walking tour uh here's some uh, moody gardens and so forth uh sea wolf park and all that kind of stuff so sent some some really nice uh rack cards and brochures they also sent a uh, sticker and they sent a couple of canned koozies and they sent look at this a flamingo ink pen. How about that? That says Visit Galveston. That's what I got in from Visit Galveston. Check them out. VisitGalveston.com. Order you one of their travel guides. And the last thing I want to show you is kind of... Uh, uh, it's kind of personal to me as far as uh, this is the radio station that I listen to the most in my area. 95.7 Duke FM out of Knoxville, Tennessee. I listen to them every day at work and I uh, listen to them in the car as well. Now, folks, you all know I'm a little bit on the older side than some of you guys. I'm, uh, I'll am i be 43 next month. But nonetheless, uh, I grew up with 90s country, okay? And they play a lot of 90s country. So I, I enjoy that. And so uh, I tune into the radio station uh, more than any of the others. They sent three stickers. Duke FM plays the legends of country. They have a nice little jingle that I'm not going to sing to you. They also sent a couple of uh, canned koozies. And they sent a couple of license plates. So thank you very much, Duke FM, 95.7 FM. And uh, so that's what I've got for you for the variety show. Kind of short today, but uh, that'll give you some time to go watch some other people. Okay? Go check me out over on Instagram with Weststar MMG over there. The link will be in the description. Also, if you're a wrestling fan, you want to see uh, uh, what new pieces of wrestling memorabilia I'm adding to my collection, go over and check me out on uh, at Pro Wrestling Immortals on Instagram. All right, leave me a comment below. Tell me what you liked in this video. Uh, also, hit that thumbs up button that tells YouTube that you enjoyed the content that you just saw. If you're new around town, hit that uh, subscribe button. I believe I'm still hovering right around 200, maybe just a little over. I might have over 200 followers, uh, excuse me, subscribers on YouTube now. So if I do, thank you so much for that. And again, if you're new, hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. All right, folks, next time will be a all hero card video. So you NASCAR buffs, you NASCAR addicts, um, make sure you tune in for that, okay? All right. That's all I've got. Have a great week. We'll talk to you soon. See ya.